this is Casey Patey of theinspiredoffice.com. I am a professional organizer. I focus on offices, paper, going digital, and workflow solutions. However, when I'm organizing myself at home, most of my time isn't spent on that stuff. It's on minimizing and going minimal and getting rid of things. So in order to be a minimalist, I don't know that I'm quite there on a good day I like to think I am, you have to constantly be getting rid of things. And we can read about that in books and articles, but we tend to make, myself included, so many exceptions to these rules, which is why I've created this video series of me getting rid of one thing at a time where I share with you the story of why I've held on to it for so long and why I'm getting rid of it now. I'm going through my closet and I am finally ready to get rid of this, this super, super cozy, yummy sweater. It's a J. Crew sweater that I bought in high school, which was in the 1990s. And I really wore the dickens out of this thing for years, but I don't think I've really worn it much since college. It sits in my um, uh, like winter bin, and every fall when I take my winter clothes out, this still never makes it as far as my closet. It stays in the winter bin. And I never end up wearing it because if it's a super, super cold day and I want to wear something comfy and cozy, I have other things in my closet that I would choose to wear over this. So when I'm helping clients organize, especially if it's outside of the office in a closet or dealing with clothing or stuff, one question I ask is, um, under what circumstance would you use or wear this thing? And for me, I would, I would only wear it on a really cold day. But then the second question is, if it's a really cold day, is this the item you would choose? Or is there something else you have that you will always choose over this? That is key. Because I have one or two really warm wool sweaters that I will always choose over this. This has some sentimental value because my best friend and I bought matching sweaters. Hers was green, mine was sort of uh, off-white and every time I pull it out I think about how cute we were buying these you know very expensive sweaters at the time together so we would match when we went to school but you know what I have other things to remind me of my friendship with her and other other reasons to laugh about about high school I don't need this sweater in my life just for that look how much space it takes up too so I'm finally ready to get rid of this. It's going to gain this much space in my crawl space where I keep my, you know, winter off-season clothes. What I want you to think about now is, is there anything in your life like this that you can get rid of? Maybe it's sort of sentimental or maybe it's a very specific piece of clothing that you will only wear in certain weather. But then ask yourself, is there something else that I will always choose over that one particular piece? If so, if something's coming to mind, please leave a comment. I would love to see a long list of things, clothing or otherwise, that folks at home are getting rid of because I am getting rid of this beloved old sweater from the 90s. Thank you so much for watching. Please visit theinspiredoffice.com to learn more about how I help people organize here in DC. I travel nationwide. I work with people virtually as well. Also on theinspiredoffice.com, you'll see my blog where I share all sorts of sort of out of the box, off the wall tips and tricks on getting organized. And if you found this video to be helpful, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. Mm -hmm.